the team play. Here's a look at the defense for the Panther football team. The defense brings back nine starters from last year's team, 10 if you include Adam Reth. That depth has created a productive offseason and made the newcomers motivated to get their name involved with the 2017 version of the Panther defense. Um, we have a lot of young guys come in that are eager to learn, you know, wanting to learn and you know, get in their playbooks. Um, something, something I haven't seen in the past before. And we've been grinding this whole summer, um, whether it's from workouts, everybody coming to workouts, putting that extra work in um, and asking questions. We obviously lost like Carter Scholl, who's all American, uh, Deshaun Dexter, lost some good players, but we got a lot of young guy, young talent coming back. Uh, I know, I think the whole back end comes back. Uh, Elijah, uh, Malcolm, AJ, all those guys. We got a lot of talent coming back. The linebacker group also brings back a lot. Three of the four starters in preseason All-American senior Jared Farley and juniors Ricky Neal and Duncan Furch. Blake Thomas also played solid minutes last year and will be a part of that nucleus in the middle. Up front, it's a list of proven producers, starting with MVFC all-newcomer team pick Hezekiah Applegate, who's coming off a big freshman season. He returns with fellow starters Preston Woods and Bryce Douglas in the middle, and the return of edge rusher and 2015 starter Adam Reth for his fifth year. Oh, uh, we always say we're kind of like the igniters. If we don't go, the defense doesn't go, so we hold our, ourselves accountable and try to just have high energy. Uh, a lot of a lot of strength, a lot of pounding, a lot of hitting. They play with a chip on their shoulder. Everyone, you know, everyone has that edge to them. Everyone comes out every day and works hard. And that's what we take pride in because that's what we're known for. When we come back, we will recap the many MVC awards for the Panther softball program and final thoughts from UNI Athletic Director David Harris.